Cineflare Object Animator makes quick work of creating animations for your videos, graphics, and text elements with an almost unlimited amount of customization options. Object Animator was created exclusively for Final Cut Pro. You can find it in the Titles browser under Cineflare Object Animator. The presets are broken up into In Animations, Out Animations, Continuous Animations, plus some tools, including instructions and a motion blur overlay. The thumbnails give you a clue on what they do, plus a hover over any of them will show you an example in the browser. Additionally, in the Effects browser are some helper effects, drop shadow, and a logo solid effect that will turn a graphic into a solid color. Object Animator presets will animate anything that is underneath them, video clips, graphics, and text. I'll drop the elastic in at the beginning of this logo, and it will bounce in from the left. Change the duration of the title to adjust its speed. The parameters are generally simple and pertain to the type of animation. In this case, we can change the direction of the in animation from all four directions plus the diagonals. The range parameter controls the distance of the animation from zero distance to 100, which is off screen. Next, you can adjust the duration and cycles or number of bounces. It's that simple. Drop the corresponding out animation at the end or try something different for a combination. Drop the motion blur effect over any of the animators to add motion blur. The continuous animations do what they say. Add a continuous animation to an item. In the parameters, we can change which axis the rotation is on and how fast it is. Plus, adjust the initial image state. Initial image state comes in handy when you have an image that you want to be larger than the screen or partially off screen. If you use Final Cut Pro's scaling and position controls, then Final Cut Pro will crop the image during the animation. Instead, you can change position and scale right in the animator and it will work perfectly. Plus, there's nothing stopping you from stacking an in and out on top of this as well. Let's create an animated title screen for a YouTube video animating on text and logos. This is something we've all done a million times in motion or after effects. Getting the keyframes right, plus adding animation tricks like overshoot, staggering, and motion blur makes this take some time. Since the animators affect everything below them, be sure to use compound clips to isolate individual animations. And with all that, I'm already done. Cineflare Object Animator 3 is an invaluable set of effects that will streamline your workflow. It gives you professional animation presets without having to leave Final Cut Pro for motion or after effects. And best of all, no keyframing. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects. And if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com. Subscribe to this channel for more great videos every week.